The Swedish Academy in Stockholm on Thursday named Mo Jan winner of the 2012 Nobel Prize in Literature. The Academy praised the Chinese writer for what it called his hallucinatory realism. It noted his ability to combine folk stories, history, and modern events in his works. An Academy official said Mr. Mo said he was overjoyed and scared when he learned he had won the award. He will receive his Nobel diploma, a medal, and more than one million dollars at a ceremony in Stockholm in December. Mo Yan is a leading author of modern Chinese novels. He often writes from memories of his youth. He also sets many of his stories in the area where he was born, Shandong Province in northeastern China. Mr. Mo's 1987 book *Red Sorghum* is an example. It is about the extreme violence in rural eastern China during the Communist Revolution in the 1920s and 1930s. The story describes the criminal culture of the time, Japan's occupation, and the terrible conditions faced by farm workers. Red Sorghum was later made into a movie. Mo Yan's other major works include Big Breasts and Wide Hips, Republic of Wine, and Life and Death Are Wearing Me Out. The Royal Swedish Academy compared him to two 20th-century writers, American William Faulkner and Colombia's Gabriel Garcia Marquez. Mo Yan is 57. His real name is Guan Mui. Mo Yan means "don't speak." The writer said he chose the name to remember to stop his tongue from getting him in trouble. Only one other Chinese language writer has won the Nobel Prize for Literature. Gao Zhengjian was honored in 2000. However, he had been living in France for some time, and China banned his books because they were critical of the Chinese government. But China is celebrating the victory of this native son. Minutes after the award was announced. Millions of Chinese expressed pleasure and pride for Mo Yan on social media websites.